Hey everyone, it's Apple Jam, and welcome back to another video. Today we're playing some more Pokemon Mystery Dungeon Explorers of Sky in the last episode. We were sent to Apple Woods in order to uh, retrieve some perfect apples for Wigglytuff, but that didn't go as planned because of a certain mono poison type team that keep screwing with us, so um... We kind of got sent to bed without dinner, which is always fun. And uh, in this episode, we're going to be dealing with it. So, let's go. Ahem, one last item. Tomorrow or the day after, or perhaps in several days' time, we plan to announce the members of the expedition party. Wow. Everyone, this is your last chance to make an impression. Work hard and impress us if you want to be chosen. Alright everyone, let's get down to work as usual. Hooray. I need to work on my hoorays. I'm so hungry. Ah, you too. You two should take care of listed jobs today. We're counting on you. There's one other thing about the expedition. You should give up on being chosen as expedition members. Huh? Why? Your failure yesterday weighs heavily. As you know, it's difficult to tell what our guildmaster is thinking from his demeanor. There is no doubt that he must be seething with anger inside. It's unlikely that he would bother to choose you for the expedition. So when the time comes to announce the members, don't get your hopes up. That's all. Well, that was a great start to the day. I was already weak from hunger, and then to be told something like that, there's no way I can get motivated now. Psst, listen up. Huh? I heard a voice somewhere. Shh! Over here! Oh, Bidoof. Shh! By golly, not so loud. Come this way. Uh, sure. So what's up? Wait, no one saw anything, except maybe Krogunk. What's going on? Why did you call us in here? Well, here you go. Oh, apples. You must be very hungry. We all set aside a little bit of our dinners last night for you. You know you're respected when Bidoof leaves a bit of his dinner for you. <laughs> Just saying. Now, eat up. Thanks, everyone. Whoa, thanks. I'm revitalized. Great. We can all use help when we're dying. Every one of us needs to be able to work hard in order to be picked for the expedition. Yup, yup. Thanks, everyone. But about the expedition, Shadow just came and told us we're probably not going to be chosen. How could you say that? There's no telling what might happen. No siree. Members haven't been picked. <coughs> Members haven't been picked yet. Everyone, thanks for trying to cheer us up, but doesn't everybody want to go on the expedition? What if we were chosen to go? If that happens, someone here might not get to go. Would you all be okay with that? No, I wouldn't like that. But of course, if someone is chosen, then someone else can't go. That's just the way it is. If you don't get picked for the expedition, you should cheer for those who did. Yup, yup, and everyone wants to go on the expedition with you, Shanks and James. Everyone, honestly, thank you. Okay then, we'll keep trying our best to get picked for the expedition. We'll keep on trying till the end. Yup, yup, that's the spirit. Yes, let's all do our best. We've got to try hard. We've got to try hard so we all get to go. I, I can read correctly, definitely. <clears throat> all right, let's go or not. Meh, <laughs> hey, you two over there. Oh, it's Krogong. Yeah, <laughs> what are you up to with Bidoof and the others? It all looks so sneaky. I suppose it's not got nothing to do with me, but... <laughs> anyway, that's not why I called you here. But the waiting's over. It's about my shop. The Krogong Swap Shop is back in business. Krogong Swap Shop? You heard right. I finally finished repairing my swap cauldron, which means that I'm finally back in business again. Put certain kinds of items in this here swap cauldron, and those items get swapped for an item offered up by another Pokemon somewhere around Treasure Town. 
There's some Pokemon around that are pretty rare items for swapping, so you could end up with a stupendously great swap. Get it? Mehehe. <laughs> so if you do feel like swapping items, you bring them to me, alright? Uh, basically explaining what he does in more detail. Basically, there's different items that can be, uh, found for different Pokemon to buff their stats, so... Uh, for example, Shinx might get an item that raises its special attack, and if you collect all of the items for that Pokemon, you can make, like, one really good one, and it... <laughs> I'll explain in more detail when we get items. Uh, cafe, I wonder what's going on. Hey, something going on? Something at the cafe? Yeah, it seems like there's some wonderful news for all the explorers. Whatever kind of wonderful news. No, I'm really interested. I'm going to go find out. I'm going to. We should probably go to. <laughs> My thoughts exactly. <laughs> well, there's a crowd. May I have everyone's attention, please? First of all, I'd like to thank you for taking time out of your busy schedules. Today I would like to give you some wonderful news of hopes and dreams. Ahem. Thanks to your kind patronage, this cafe has been quite popular. We've been fortunate to have so many wonderful customers. This shop's pride and joy, the recycle shop, which I haven't used yet, is fully, fully operational and has collected many items. We'd like to thank you for your kind patronage by opening a new service. We're calling it Project P. Project P? What's that? The project aims to use the items gathered at the recycle shop in order to explore unexplored places. Allow me to explain. Right now at the recycle shop, you trade several items in exchange for one of the shop's items. Thanks to everyone's continued recycling efforts, we have gathered a lot of items here at the shop. The service will continue to operate in the same manner, and now with Project P established, you might be wondering how Project P fits into all of this. We'll use the accumulated items to explore unexplored areas. There are still so many places around the world that are waiting to be found and explored. So many secret treasures and challenging puzzles waiting to be discovered. Let's go out and find them. That's what Project P is all about. Ah, the pursuit of knowledge. On continuing exploration, we'll find dazzling treasures and new exploration areas. Probably. If you bring your discoveries back to the cafe, you'll get a special deal at the recycle shop. This should keep items circulating through the recycle shop. The items at the recycle shop will become more and more amazing. What do you think? Do you understand? Yes, indeed. Use the recycled items to explore the world. So you think it's a magnificent project full of hopes and dreams? Whoa, this is genius. It seems so economical. We've already sent out an exploration team to find unexplored areas. There should be new discoveries before long. Spoiler! So everyone, please keep recycling more and more every day. Let's all work together and find unexplored areas. Hooray! Wow, so amazing. Recycling leftover items, trading them around, and they're bound to turn into unbelievable treasures. Being able to explore unexplored areas. Woohoo, I'm so excited. We should recycle more. Yeah. Yeah, we should. Well, uh, I will meet you guys here again when I am ready. Okay, and let's go. Oh, I, I forgot about that. Uh, let's actually no. Let's, let's send wheel back. All right, let's go. And that are through to level 11. Okay. 
Okay, so first boss fight. Uh, Anarath kind of used up both of my reviver seeds in like one fight because he's just that amazing at doing things. So, uh, Lily can't fin. Like that's not allowed. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna sleep in. So what I'm going to do is this, to get Lily out of the way, and then we can continue the battle as normal. I'm going to set Ember, and let's go. We're not doing a ton of damage. And I missed an Ember. There we go. Okay, that was kind of close. Alright, that's that. We shall continue. And here we go. Finally completed this mission. And we will continue. And the next start loss. So, I don't have... Oh no, I have a stun seed, okay. Okay, so how am I going to do this? Let's get this. Um, I have a plan. So let's throw the stun seed. Get as far back as I can. And then we will throw some Geo Pebbles. Those aren't doing much damage. Okay then. Always bring about 50 reviver seeds, people. Damn, what is the second time I've wiped out? This is not ideal. Uh, that, that, that really sucks. Well, I will leave it at that for today. Because I don't really want to do that again, so in the next episode we will continue in doing stuff and hopefully I'll be more prepared for it this time. So I uh, hope you all enjoyed this video, if you did be sure to leave a like, leave a comment down below if you have any thoughts, subscribe for more and I will see you guys next time, goodbye.